Welcome to another analysis of the lock of the night. This time we're going to look at Friday, September 21st, race 6, quarter horses going quarter horse maidens going 300 yards here. Uh the distance, we got a field of 7. And again, these are the Los Alamitos official night lines past performances. You can get them at losalamitos.com. And also if you want the printout, you can buy them on site at Los Alamitos in a very various uh simulcast outlets throughout Southern California. So Nightline Lines, the official PPs of Los Alamitos, get them at losalamitos.com. We got a field of seven. And uh, if you're a follower of uh, my nightly lock of the night on TVG, the quarters, you know that it's not gonna be the morning night favorite. So the morning night favorite is actually gonna be a first time starter here for the Jose Flores barn. Um, uh, this one for the juniors quarter horses, five to two on the morning line. And that is because of that very good drill of 12-10 on the 28th of August. So um, if you want my detailed analysis of every horse, um, oh, did you see that? You see that glitch? The the lines actually, the notes scooted up towards the next horse. But uh, special, of course, going to be a lock of the night there. Uh, like I was saying, if you want my detailed uh, analysis trip notes for every horse in this race, I have one already. Uh, but I want to make this video nice and short. So I'm not going to give you every detail of every single horse, but, uh, you know, just turn into the quarters. I'll give you my nightly, uh, my detailed analysis of every single horse with trip notes, um, trouble notes, work out analysis and all that. So, uh, just to give you a little bit insight of why this horse is, uh, is a more nine favorite, uh, 12, 10, that worked out on the 28th of August here. And this horse was actually a hundred thousand dollars purchase at the Los on Los on Medios equine sale. So six figures uh, for this two-year-old gelding by Walk to the Fire out of Special and Proud. Uh, so they paid a good pretty penny for this one. Uh, so they're obviously hoping uh, they have a good one here. And you know, he started a little bit slow in the workouts. Didn't really show all that much, but then really improved in the latest one, 1210 there. Um, you can see this one is paid into the Golden State in the two million futurity trial. So uh, they're they're trying to debut this one now and see what they've got and see if they got a good one for the big trials later on in the year. So uh, he's going to be the morning fairy based on that uh, that very good workout where uh, you know he would he would work on the outside of a partner was a little bit sluggish out of the gate uh, maybe a half half step bobble there in the first few st uh, few strides was tapped once. And finish strong there through the lane so uh would finish would win the drill by about three quarters of a length and and the type of 12 10 like we mentioned um so i like what i saw in the second half of the drill uh i kind of wanted to see a little bit more coming out of the gate but all in all he finished uh, very nicely there to stop the clock in 12 10 so there's definitely some talent there uh but tonight i'm not gonna pick him i'm gonna wait and see and see if he can uh, if he can really show some of that talent later on in the night under the light. So tonight, the lock of the night is going to be Chocolatito here for Scott Willoughby and Ed Allred. This one is actually bred by Dr. Steve Burns. So uh, it's not a homebred for Allred. He actually went out to the sale and bought this one for $50,000. So he paid fifty k for this one. Uh, he's also paid into the Golden State in the $2 million. I like that workout back on the July 21st before that debut on the 24th of August. So... Um, he went off a tour to one that night. He would finish fourth, but would be DQ'd to six. Kind of maybe half hopped a little bit out of the start, veered in, bumped the uh, two rivals along the inside, and that's why he got DQ'd. But I like the way he finished. He kind of lost his path. He altered out and finished with a good amount of run once the rider asked him to. Uh, so I like what I saw. I think with a clean start and a little bit of a improvement, this horse. Uh, could run a much improved effort. So I'm banking that the race experience is going to trump the the debut uh, debut runner here on, uh, down the middle part of the gate. So Chocolatito is going to be the lock of the night here for Friday, uh, September 21st. Let's take a look at the start back on August 24th here for Chocolatito. All right, we're going to take a look at Chocolatito's debut run back on August 24th. He would break from post number six. So take a look at star, uh, post six here. Chocolatito is going to Kind of hop a little bit out of the start right there. Gonna be in, bump the six and the five, uh, six and four, excuse me. Um, and then he's gonna lose his path right here. He's gonna angle to the outside. Once the rider asks here with the right hand, he really responds nicely here and finishes fourth. 
uh, he would eventually be DQ'd and place sixth in that effort. But the the winner there, final eighth, 9.66. That was a sharp final eighth for that winner. That winner, uh, favorite motions. She actually pointing uh, could be pointing towards the Golden State Million Patriot trials in a couple of weeks. But Chocolatito there, years in right here bumps the six with Jen bumps the four. That would cause him to get DQ'd. But at this point, he's gonna the seven is gonna take over that path. Chocolatito is going to angle out to the outside and then uh, at this point he's got a quite a bit of ground to make up the rider goes to the right hand he's really going to respond nicely and would end up finishing fourth based on all that trouble I think he, he could have easily finished third there uh, with all that trouble in that start but then again I thought it was an education to debut the winner here was much the best that night over a length so one seven two and then Chocolatito fourth by a long neck. Could have probably finished third when uh, if you factor in all the trouble and all that. So I think he's coming off out of a good race. Uh, like I mentioned, the winner could be pointing towards big things in the Golden State Million uh, Futurity Trials in a couple of weeks. So Chocolatito, the lock of the night here for Friday, September 21st.